Hello everyone and welcome to the 10th season of Hermitcraft UEC! Hello! Wow! <laughs> Number 10! Woohoo, it's been so long since the last one, but we're here back in 1.9. Blame Biffa. <laughs> Blame Biffa, hashtag. And me! <laughs> <laughs> oh. So we're back here in 1.9 and we're playing with a little bit of a twist, which is that after... How long is it? Four episodes, 80 minutes, everyone is going to be glowing because of the glow <sighs> effect in 1.9. So that means you'll be able to see other people in the world wherever they are, as long as they're in render distance, of course. And as well as that, we're going to have a shrinking world. So after three episodes, the world is going to shrink from a thousand blocks down to 100 over the course of an hour. And what else is there for me to tell you? Oh yeah, we're playing on custom terrain, so the above ground area will look slightly different. If you look down below, it kind of looks normal, but it's definitely different. And underground, you'll find that there's going to be uh, more ores, more diamonds, more gold. Not a terrible amount, but if you find gold, sorry, diamonds above like Y16, um, then that's completely normal. Uh, the never is allowed, but no level 2 or regeneration potions. And we're all going to have an elytra as well. How cool is that? Who's looking forward to flying? And I dying. I've never died. Oh, wait, wait, what is that? What is I'm that? Not do it. I'm not going to do it at all. Literally flying and dying. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, some people might say, oh, it's overpowered, but there's there's a lot of risk and not a lot of reward for using an elytra in a yeah. UHC. So it's a novelty. Maybe someone will get to make use of it. Anyway, that's going to be it. So I wish everyone some good luck. Good luck. Good luck. I, I wish me and Ren good luck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Good it. luck, Ren. <laughs> good luck, eggs. Two, one. Oh, there we go. Oh, am I in you? I am in you. I, I don't know. I hope not. Uh, howdy, Drax. Hi. How's it going, Joe? Pretty good. I'm excited. We are playing a UHC, which stands for Unreal Human Competition, I believe. <laughs> Unreal Human Competition. I, you know, I've heard it come called a lot of things, but not that. Right. Well, you know, I, I think that when people spend more time around me, they get to, you know, really experience that things can be called many things, you know? <laughs> this, this is true. This is true. You know, we right. probably should have checked to make sure that there aren't, like, other people actively around us first, because I don't know how the space and algorithm in this particular UHC works, but, uh, yeah. Also, oh, there I'm is... going to punch stuff. That's a good rule. I, I like the rule that if you see a person, you punch them, too. Okay, yeah. I've got my first wooden pick. I'm going to try and find some stone exposed. Boom. Hey, coal, too, but let's get a stone pick. So, yeah, I'm hoping I, my last Hermitcraft UHC that I was a part of, I didn't do too hot. So I'm hoping that, you know, I do a little bit better of a show this time around than, than last time. Well, I mean, I'm famously a world-class PvP player, as long as that's, like, person versus pepperoni and not anything <laughs> about video games. Because, like, I'll, I could eat a pizza right now. You right. know how they're like, oh, yeah, athletes, you know, you got to eat really well to perform at your optimal. Hey, I got a stone pick for you here. Oh, nice, nice. Thank you. You're uh, dropping it. There it is. Um, you got to eat well if you're going to perform optimally. I did not do that. I skipped breakfast today. My lunch was probably not a very good lunch, so I'm expecting that this is going to be one of those games where we're going to have a fun time, and <laughs> hopefully hopefully other people have a fun time too. Yeah, I was, you know, I'm kind of in the same boat. I was actually getting ready to go get dinner, and then I got the message like, hey, you know, we need your help. And so I came <laughs> and haven't had dinner yet, so I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to, to dinner. So maybe, maybe <laughs> dying early would be a good thing, but... Well, yeah, I also, I lined up a babysitter for this, who in this case was my wife, because I was like, do, do you need me to get a real babysitter? And she's like, no, 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 I can watch her daughter. I'm like, okay, cool, you're going to take her somewhere else, right? She can't be in the house for this. You know, I can I can get a babysitter to take her somewhere. And she's like, no, 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 I got this. She's like, okay, so I'm just going to take her down to go swimming. It's like, well, that's like right nearby. Like, if she <laughs> does not do well swimming, what's your plan? Oh, I'll just take her back upstairs. Like, no, you can't. That's not a plan. That is a bad plan. 
Do you not know how long a UHC lasts, woman? Come on. Yeah, there's going to be 25 years of, you know, whatever it is we're doing. Um, yep. Okay, I've got an extra stone sword for you here. I, I got all my stone tools already. Okay, great. I'm going to stone axe this um, tree to fall over. Tree feller would be awesome. They haven't added that to Minecraft yet, have they? No, unfortunately. I mean, there's all sorts of stuff that would be wonderful if they added, but, you know. I mean, when are we going to get a real function in democracy in Minecraft? Not yet. Uh, now I I don't know about you, but I haven't I haven't really played Minecraft heavily in in a good little while, so I could be a little rusty when it comes to this. Like they they said something about us having some tool that oh we when do we get that the uh... yeah we're supposed to all have an Elytra and it doesn't seem to be equipped on us. It's possible that everybody except us got an Elytra, <laughs> and we're the only ones who aren't going to waste the time to complain about it. Yep. Because it seems like if nobody had one, everyone would be screaming. Or maybe right. they're just like in chests scattered around the map, so they're supposed to be really easy to get. Okay, I got some pig meat if we want to cook stuff. Do we want to build a base or something? We, we probably should, because um, that's that's what you do. You, you start out and you, you build a house to where you can defend yourself and have you know protection during the night, correct? I mean... Yeah, that's, I mean, I'm I'm worried about works. nighttime. That's where that's where scary things are. Um, are is you still there kinda, nighttime? <laughs> I, th I think that why would they turn off nighttime? I just, sometimes they do in UAC. I'm not sure. Oh no, that's terrible. Um, because that means I have no idea how the physics of the world work. I don't right. know if I'm orbiting a planet or if I'm orbiting how, the sun. How am I supposed to tell which direction I'm going if I can't see the day or if the day doesn't change? Okay, right. well, if we need to find a place to dig in and actually build a furnace, because I'm getting hungry already. And I want to cook this meat. All right. Do you have enough um, enough stone to build a furnace, or do we need to have I have walls? enough on me to build a furnace, yes. And I'm going to kill some more piggies over here. Okay. Well, I'm going to grab uh, some stuff and get, get a little furnace going, too. For those of you that have seen my last UHC performance, I have learned how the sword works this time. And I can handle killing pigs without... Oh, wait. Maybe I can handle killing pigs. I, uh, last time I, I didn't realize the mechanic that you couldn't swing a lot and it wouldn't do any damage and I died within the first night. Wow, you've played UHC a lot more recently than I have. So Yeah, it was it was during the snapshots, I think, was the last time I had played. All right, so you're right over here. Hello. I'm kind of d dug a little hole into the wall here. Give um, you some more meat. Thank you. All right. We got enough coal to make quite a good number of torches, too. I have, I have 48 coal on me. Yeah, I feel like that's a little excessive, but on the same time, you know, like, I don't want to die because of a creeper. Like, right, right. We want torches. Those are those are important. I'm going to, while it's still day, I am going to kill all the piggies around here. <gasps> a There's move. a person. <gasps> Where? Um, Hold on. I'm coming back to you, and I need to eat, and then we can go and attack. I don't know what direction anything uh, is from us. I am behind you. Is there a gentleman's rule? Did we did we establish? No, there's no gentleman's rule this game. Oh. So, uh, yeah, grab some pork chops. I'll guard you while. Where right. did you see people? So they were to your kind of straight ahead to where you're looking. There, there's that little hill right over there. I can see false. Mm -hmm. It's false. Okay. Well, there's two of us and one of her. Should we go and forward? whoever else is on our team. I mean, I think we should, right? That's how the game works. That's we don't know if she has swords yet. And cube fan. I, I mean, let's assume she doesn't have a sword yet. Let's just go. And if she has a sword, then we'll run away. I'm scared. False is dangerous when it comes to PvP. Okay, well, I mean, you... we're dangerous too, you know? Oh, goodness. Oh, I think goodness. she's fleeing us. That's probably a good sign. That means, you know, we're intimidating. Iskul just earned time to strike. That means Iskul just got a sword now. Okay, False is definitely right here. She does have a sword, but she's alone. She's alone. And I don't All think right. she's seen us. I don't have a... A bow would be nice, but... A bow would be nice, but, you know, it's not like we can turn wool blocks into string. <laughs> she's hunting a sheep. Does she know something we don't know? Dang it, I'm so close. <laughs> she hasn't seen you yet. Oh, She's God. now running. <laughs> I'm trying to catch up. Trying to navigate uh, this terrain is not easy. Oh, okay, oh. her partner's now now with her. I there might be a gentleman's rule. There was if she's not. saying twenty men's. What does that mean? I I don't know. 
Is it, I mean, if, we, we iron didn't have hill. like Isuma explained all the rules. There was no gentleman's rule. Okay, mm. I found their base. Do you want to get the iron and all kind of? They're 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 wary about approaching me. Yeah, that's we're curious. Nope. Always, yeah. See, that's what I figured. Always. All right. So I I stole the iron out of the hill, and I'm running back. Okay. Well, we we stole some of their iron, and oh, here's more. <laughs> Rude. <laughs> All right. It's running back. Gonna... Man, they have a ton of coal. Oh, dang it! I just took some fall damage. Wish I had that Elytra if I knew how to use it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It'd be nice. All right, so we know they're close. So after first episode, we could we could go on the offensive. Is anyone? Do you have a timer running? I don't have a timer. I don't know when we were gonna hit twenty minutes. Uh, well, it'll say um, twenty minutes. Really? I thought everybody said, "Do we have a way to have it say twenty minutes?" And everyone was like, "No, we don't have that." I'm pretty sure that he said it will. Okay. Um, but yeah, we've only been maybe eight minutes, according to my open broadcast software. Excellent. Okay. So, uh, yeah, here's some additional iron. All right. Well, that was going to be exciting there for a whole two minutes, and then it stopped. Now, you can't repair. Oh, yeah, you can repair, but it's not worth it. Right? Yeah. Okay. Get that. I'm going to start making iron hardware. swords. Nice. Okay, so I could use some torches, so I'm going to make those. Oh, I forget about the whole other slot. Okay, I got an iron sword I'm going to toss down to you here. All right. Uh, it's kind of on the stairs. I'll grab it. Cool. Okay, so we're starting to get into nighttime here. Go ahead and close, uh, smelt some uh, some cobble and close up our, our hole behind us, or dirt yeah. or something. Yeah, good idea. I was going to use dirt, but yeah, your idea is better. I mean, not that they're not, I mean, they know exactly the angle we came from. This is correct. But we saw them before they saw us. You know, if there really is some sort of gentleman's rule, then there's nothing stopping us from going over there and just taking stuff out of their chests, right? <laughs> no, no, I guess not. All right, let's see. Uh, wait, how do I... There it is, okay. It's like, how do I use this other thing in my hand? Okay, so I th do we need an iron pick? I guess if we want to get diamonds, so I should yep. craft one of those because uh, that's we've got three um, three iron left. Oh, I've got five iron on me. Let me bring them back okay. up to you. Yeah, because we just finished. Uh... Okay, I'm gonna run downstairs then and start digging while you do that. I mean, I know this is a timed thing, and that we don't absolutely need to have these stairs be three high, but like, I'm I'm probably gonna do it just out of neuroses. <laughs> it's not it's not me complaining about you. It's that I'm unable to be a functional human being. <laughs> it's all right. So I'm uh, a little iron deposit here too. How how are you uh, how are you finding the weather here lately? It's been it's been a little wet here in Nashville. It has been. A lot of you guys <laughs> may not realize it, but Drax also lives in Nashville, Tennessee. Yep. I'm not well, from Nashville. I just live in Nashville. So I mean, I'm from Tullahoma, which is like 80 miles southeast. So I can't really say I'm from Nashville <laughs> in the traditional sense, but. But I coming still, to you always from Nashville. I Tennessee. am broadcasting from Nashville, Tennessee, or recording yeah. in Nashville, Tennessee. Um, I actually recorded at the top of the Sears Tower the other day. Oh, in Chicago? Nice. Yeah, I was just like, oh, I'm on top of a really tall building. It's a lot like opening Google Maps. Like, <laughs> I should probably make a video of this. I um, I would like to record from the top of the Batman building here in Nashville. I think that'd be kind of neat. You know, there's a uh, restaurant on top of the Sheraton building. Really? I had no idea. Yeah, that circular thing on top of the, the Sheraton building, was a, it was originally a rotating restaurant. But apparently the mechanics on that were not really up to snuff. And so they were like, well, <laughs> let's just keep it at one orientation. And uh, yeah, that's good enough for us. 
Well, I might have to try that. Is it a good restaurant? Have you ever been? I've never been because it's also like a, a super high-end restaurant. But your, your wife's a chef, right? So, like, yep. you can justify this as, like, opposition research. Whereas, <laughs> you know, um, I'll, I'll be like, oh, hey, honey, you want to go somewhere really fancy for this holiday or something? And she's like, well, I'm a, a grad student, so that's probably not the best use of our limited resources. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is true. This is true, yeah. But, uh, yeah, you know. Have you hit uh, a cave down there yet? You know, it's funny, just as you asked that, I have indeed hit a cave down there yet. All right, cool. And let's see, there's a bat and probably some skeletons, but I don't see any. I just hit another iron deposit, so we might be doing pretty good here. Yeah. I'm going to hop back up and bring the iron I have, just so, uh... Oh, I should probably eat a little bit, too. All right. Dang it. I'm kind of, like, wishing I'd slab the stairs... So that I could not have to waste a bunch of food jumping, but that's yeah, something. I do that every time I think about it, or every time I, I uh, do this. It's like, man, I really, really should have done that. Now I'm hitting the ceiling. <laughs> I'm sorry that my staircase isn't. It's not stair ready. It's uh -oh. not. It's not. We didn't helpful. put a torch up here. Where did you? Did you go back down? Where did you go? I did. I. I uh, tiered off another direction, yep. Okay. Well, enjoy that. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. Whoops. Yeah, come up here and all of a sudden there's a... Yeah, I was going to say, yeah, it was completely dark when I got up there. We were so dependent on the furnaces for light, as we should be. I'm just going to accidentally fall into the cave if I keep walking backwards and putting down these stairs. But at the same time, this is the most effective way to place this number of stairs. It is, very much so. All right. I'm going to try and get myself an iron pick here. Dur -dur -dur. Riveting footage here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm staring at the furnace, waiting for it to go. Wow, uh, if you look at the health bar, False only lost half a heart, apparently. Or she regenerated it somehow. How did you uh, hit her? With a sword. Oh, wow, really? Yeah, I don't know. I thought a sword would do more damage, but it was stone, so maybe not. Could be, yeah. Maybe it was too far away, or because I was kind of spamming it, it like did the reduced damage. Okay, yep. there's definitely at least a zombie down here. And there's definitely at least a zombie up here. I know that much. Okay. All right, so I'm coming down to you. Well, in this cave, I definitely see some more iron. We should probably make some... Oh, that's a zombie. We should probably make some iron armor before we explore the cave too heavily. Yeah, I think we're just so, waiting so for So why don't you run upstairs and uh, see if it's smelted before you come down to join me. Oh, well, because you're already here. <laughs> okay, I have 13 iron. In do you have one door. stair left? What do you mean? Do you have a stair? You forgot one. Well, I have three stairs left, so there we go. <laughs> Next problem. Okay, so now that we have our beautiful stairwell, that is a marvel that all will want to behold. Um, okay, so we've got 18 iron, to or you just grab some, it looks like. So I'm going to make a chest plate. What's, is there a, like a ratio where it's like chest plates are better than pants or something? I, I don't know. <laughs> uh, well, here, have some pants. Thanks. I made a hat, so don't give me a hat. Okay. I, I didn't make... Okay, yeah, I'm out of iron now. All right. I'll just put my good sword out like while I'm building stuff and planning. Yeah. Okay. So then once we get uh, four iron here, I'm going to go ahead and uh, make some little booties. <laughs> the little booties. Mm -hmm. Shaking in my little space boots. All right, so what do we got? What do we got? Is that gold? No, that's iron. They said that the uh, the uh, ore stuff generates higher in this map, so that way people don't have to go all the way. We won't spend the whole day like mining down to level zero or whatever. Oh, okay. So it might, it might actually be gold, and there might actually be diamonds higher up than usual. Maybe not this high, but higher than usual. That is not how that works. There we go. Ah! Don't come in here. <laughs> Spiders are chasing me. Okay. I can't wait. We need to get some actual bow and arrows. So. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So if we need gravel, we need feathers, and we need string at this point to, in order to really make that happen. I'm worried about skeletons, though, because uh, they are so brutal in UHC. 
Yes, they are. And I, I 100% hear one around me. Oh, yep, there he is. Okay, I found some gold. Remember, if we put down some extra torches too, that'll discourage stuff from spawning. Yeah, I see the guys that you're. Oh, yeah, there's two skeletons right there and a zombie. Oh, he hit me. Oh, but I killed him. That yeah. one sees me. There's, there's a second one. I think he's targeting me though. This is not ideal. This is not. No, in no way, shape, or form is this ideal. Well, it's like caves are great as long as you're not, you know, getting killed by the stuff inside the caves. Yeah. That's really when they go downhill. Okay, so here's another cave. I'm sure there's stuff inside of this one that wants me dead. I wonder if mine uh, shafts or whatever are turned on. I was going to say, I wonder if Minecrafts are turned on. <laughs> so I go, I don't know. Is it open? <laughs> Did you open the launcher and type in your authentication credentials? Are if so, you... yeah, Minecrafts are probably on. Have you Dirt. have you uh, made sure it's turned on? All right, Dirt. plug it in. Okay. Zuljan just made a crafting bench. Oh, I got hit again. No. Well, it's possible that whoever he's working with is, uh, you know, yep. handling all the. Who else is on his team? Oh yeah, XP crafted. I mean, that guy has craft in his name. He's taking care of that 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 hard stuff. Here's open. Let's... Letting Zuljin just kind of coast through. Okay. Okay, I found some iron. That's nice. What's, is there any use for gold in this? Uh, golden apples? Or, those are something, right? Yeah, golden apples, uh, I do believe, is probably going to be your best use for that. Mm -hmm. um, I can't think of anything else offhand that would use it, but... Yeah, we probably should have tried hitting the trees. Yeah, I think in order to try and shake loose some apples. Uh, did they come from all types of trees or? No, just oak, and I don't think we had oak around us. No, we had that dark oak, which is so much more moody and right. sullen. All right, I didn't get any string from that spider. I just okay. Killed. You know what? I also didn't do is uh, repair my pick, so it just broke. So luckily, I got at least th I got eight iron, so I can use three of those to repair my pick, and then have I'm five ahead, so I'll build a helmet. All right. Are you doing okay on armor? Would you rather have the iron for your your stuff? I mean, I got a helmet and a pair of leggings, and then okay. there's iron around, so I mean, I'll probably get enough for iron here shortly. Cool, cool, cool. Twenty minutes. 